The Issaquah School District plays a vital role in the growth and development of our local economy. The Issaquah School District employs more than 2,000 people who live, work, shop, and access numerous professional services in the community. Our reputation for great schools is a key element in maintaining home values as well as attracting businesses looking to relocate to our region. In these ways, the Issaquah School District is an important contributor to the economic growth of the greater Issaquah Sammamish area. And what they're looking for, not only the talent that a strong school system provides our town, but also for the families that are moving here, they want their kids to be in the best position to succeed in the global economy. And so the Issaquah School District really helps provide us with that economic development advantage within the region. We're very lucky to have that. In my experience working with buyers and sellers, I've found that regardless of whether or not you have children, that school district is just really important to property values. The good news is Issaquah is blessed with an outstanding school system. I learned from talking to the recent arrivals and folks that have been here for a while that one of the first things they do when they consider moving to a community is check out the school system. To thrive in the 21st century, communities need an excellent working relationship between the business community and the school district to respond to the ever-changing needs of a dynamic economy. Our local high-tech companies are looking for employees with education and skills for their companies, and we need to keep that in our community. And education is important to sustain that economy, and it's important to the families who live here. Students who do well in school do better in life. Things are changing so fast, and to make sure that the K through 12 and the workforce development work that we're fortunate to have going on here is connected directly with the employer community so we can provide skilled, ready workers to enter the job market, succeed, and have a wage that can support a family and support a community. That is critical for success. Strong schools and strong local businesses go hand in hand. Growth in enrollment and the desire to reduce class sizes drive the need to provide additional classroom and instructional areas for our students. The Issaquah School District has experienced steady growth for the past two decades, and we continue to add three to 500 students each year to the system. Remodeling projects that add classroom space and building new schools are necessary to accommodate growth and lower class sizes. One of the other advantages of a remodeled or um, addition to a, a school is that it allows us to create an improved learning environment. We're able to provide what we need for active boards, for greater numbers of computers, and the ability for teachers to use the classroom technology embedded in their instructional practices. The kids absolutely love being in this classroom. There's more space. They have the ability to go to their lab tables and do ob make observations in ponds. They can spill water. They can look at microorganisms. Our field was remodeled and rebuilt, uh, which has been a significant improvement to our physical space, both for students, staff, and our community members. The track itself is a tremendous asset uh, to our kids, again, as, as up to uh, 600 kids a day use that space for PE and running and athletics, in addition to the after school activities. I sincerely thank our community for making these improvements to Maywood Middle School possible. At the start of the school year, we were able to go through a full audit, top to bottom, to better enhance our security and safety for our schools and our sites. Projects to enhance and install upgraded security systems are underway. Camera systems are being installed at all of our elementary schools, while middle and high schools are receiving upgraded surveillance systems. In remodeled buildings, school offices are being relocated to provide a better line of sight to the entry, and access points into schools are being reduced wherever possible. Here at Liberty High School, um, security is very important to us. Um, we uh, owe it to our public to make sure that their kids are safe when they're here, and this surveillance system uh, goes a long way in making sure that happens. At Issaquah School District, we want your students and our staff to be as safe as possible.
Sustainability has been an integral part of our design process for as long as I've been with the district. It's not something that's special or unique. It's just something that we've always done. We're going to look at site orientation, orientation of the building, solar angles, wind, views. All those things become factors in the design. In the Issaquah School District, we've moved to two-story elementary and three-story high schools to reduce the footprint of our buildings. We've also reduced impervious surface areas around the buildings and added rain gardens to allow more natural water to infiltrate into the ground. Inside the buildings, we look for the most efficient ways to heat, cool, and ventilate to maintain a high-quality indoor environment. Maximizing daylight is another priority, as the natural daylight not only creates a pleasing environment, it's effective in reducing overall electrical consumption. All of the sustainable strategies that we incorporate in our buildings reduce consumption, reduce costs. So where we can reduce operational costs, that's money that can go back into the classroom. Our district has worked with local utilities to obtain grants to install demonstration projects to enhance student learning. For example, photovoltaic solar arrays are operating at Liberty High School and Grand Ridge Elementary. At Liberty, students in math, statistics, and science classes can use the energy data that's provided as part of their curriculum. Grand Ridge also has a wind turbine on its grounds, so students can monitor the output of their solar array and compare it to the wind turbine. Those are really interesting and exciting things that uh, come out of those demonstration projects and, and enhance the education of the kids. It really helps center them on sustainability and it's something that they'll carry forward in their life. In our new classroom, we're able to make connections not just in our local community where kids can step out and take a closer look at the ecosystems, but they can make the connection globally and see what we do in our own world, how that impacts the global scale. Good teachers and motivated students can perform well in almost any environment, but a well-designed facility truly enhances performance and makes the educational process more rewarding and enjoyable. GCCM stands for General Contractor Construction Manager. It's a project delivery method that allows an owner to engage a construction manager during the design process for input on the scheduling, pricing, and phasing of a project. A guaranteed maximum price for the construction is agreed upon based on the defined scope and schedule of the project. We've been through that process and we've selected Cornerstone General Contractors to work with us. Having a General Contractor Construction Manager on board allows us to avoid the situation where in a conventional design bid build project we'd have four separate bids, potentially four separate General Contractors. Here we've got one General Contractor Construction Manager that's working with us as a team to move forward and complete this project safely and efficiently. We believe that GCCM is a great way to go for our corridor projects of Issaquah Middle School rebuild, Clark Elementary rebuild, and the redesign and remodeling of our new secondary campus. We have tight timelines and a lot of staging that's required that lends itself very well to the GCCM model. The benefits of doing the GCCM process are that the school district, the contractor, and the design team get to sit at the same table in a collaborative environment through the pre-construction process of the project. And what that means is that we get to, as the contractor, bring our expertise to the table in public safety, logistics, budgeting, quality control, attracting very highly qualified subcontractors, and presenting the information to them in a way that helps them be very competitive in their pricing, ultimately resulting in a bid that has a complete scope and achieves the goals of the project. On a typical lump sum project, the owner carries a significant amount of the risk on their shoulders. By having us on the team, we share a lot of that risk with them as it relates to schedule and price certainty and quality. We're a vested partner with the school district in the success of the project.
We're so fortunate in the Issaquah School District. We have such wonderfully supportive families and a wonderfully supportive business community and just above all, amazing kids. So to be able to provide them and our teachers with the very best teaching and learning facilities is really at the heart of what we do. The fact that we have such an outstanding school system here has evolved in tremendous civic pride between our schools and our community. You could talk about property values, you could talk about all those other issues, but having great schools just makes for a better community. Our school district is fantastic, and we know that people move here, residents, businesses, for the school district. We think that is one of our largest assets, and the community really wraps its arms around the schools to not only provide a great learning experience for the kids, but to make sure that our community remains vital and a healthy, safe place to be. I think the most important thing from our recent remodel project in addition to the improvements in academic spaces and in spaces uh, for teaching and learning to occur is the pride that the new remodel in the building instilled uh, in our kids. The pride of ownership, the pride of where they go to school. I like to refer to that as our curb appeal. From our brand new performing arts center to our newly renovated science classrooms, to all of our new career and technical education classrooms like Intro to Engineering, Computer Science, this is a facility that staff, students, and the community can be proud of. The new Liberty High School could have never come to fruition if it weren't from the support of our parents and our community through the last construction bond. That provided capital to make this project happen, and fast forward three years later, it's an amazing facility. We have our community to thank for it. We have been at the school for now three years and just going from an open school to an all-in-one building school has been great. Just having all the kids at the same place gives us more security and we feel like they feel better being all in one building. We moved from North Carolina a year ago and Joshua never had any babysitters or preschools or anything. And coming to Essequa, and the first day we saw the school, we were like, this is in the right place. And right away, my husband and I and Joshua, we were very happy that he will be there for a long time. We are really proud of our new neighborhood school. <laughs>